the honey bee. A stalwart sign of any healthy living ecosystem, from forests to grasslands to the verdant green mountains of British Columbia. Today, however, we're going to be looking at a different kind of ecosystem, the diverse landscape of Canada's largest independent electronic music festival, Shambhala. It is connected by a central village of artisans and local food vendors, some of which comes from the land itself. As Planet Shambhala serves as a fully functional farm the rest of the year, nestled deep in the verdant forest of the Kootenai Mountain Range. Spread across many hectares, Shambhala contains six diverse stage environments catering to a wide variety of eclectic music aficionados. They come to party, and they know how to do it right. Australia migrate to the laser-saturated foliage of the fractal forest. A few meters from the central artisan's plaza, attendees turn to otherworldly divination to determine their spirit animals. <laughs> this one is a beaver, Canada's national symbol. Though Shambles, as it's affectionately known, is famous for its insouciant party atmosphere, self-care is one of the most important aspects of a successful participant. It's not uncommon for one to see base heads engaged in midday yoga sessions. Though, once the drop hits, it's an entirely different story. When the sun sets, Shambhala ignites. infrastructure and ethos, a connection to the natural world provides both spiritual and dietary sustenance. Despite the influx of humanity and the presence of earth rumbling frequencies, Mother Nature is resplendent in her glory. The Wish Tree in hopes that the rave deities fulfill their very desires, party goers affix their dreams to the bows of this legendary perennial. Here, in their natural habitat, base heads endemic to these environs flaunt their plumage. Whether born natural, 
or developed through an elaborate game of pick it up, put it on. Costumes from home and ground scores intermingle in a sparkling visual cacophony. Once on site at Shambhala, bass music heavyweights from sleeveless records and deep, dark, and dangerous congregate in what DJ Kane would call a ting up. Every year, 11,000 fans and 4,000 crew, volunteers, and artists come together to create the largest city in southeastern British Columbia for only a week. stages creates diverse environments in which today's music and performance artists can unleash their creativity on a unique audience cultivated and drawn to each experience. You will see how the village, the living room, the amphitheater, the grove, and the pagoda each make their own unique environment something special that can only exist on planet Shambhala.